Hey everybody, it's time for another end of the year wrap up video. As has become tradition here on the channel over the past couple of years, I like to take one of my last videos for the end of the year and sort of sum things up, talk a little bit about what's been happening on the channel, what I plan to have happen in the future, and life in general. For those of you who are into that sort of thing, buckle up because this one might be a little long. For those of you who aren't into that sort of thing, there's tons of other stuff here that you might enjoy watching more. So, 2018. Let's talk a little bit about 2018. I had some pretty specific goals in mind for this YouTube channel for the year. Primarily with regard to continuing to put out consistent, high-quality content, despite the fact that I had made a commitment to dial back my participation in YouTube as a platform this year. Those of you who've been watching the channel for many years are no doubt familiar with the fact that in 2017 I put out twice as many videos as I did here in this past year. But one of the things I really wanted to try to do in 2018 was to increase or at the very least maintain the quality of the content that I was putting out despite there being less of it. And I really feel as though I managed to accomplish that in a lot of different regards. I feel pretty strongly that the content that I put out in 2018 here on YouTube is probably the best content that I've ever put out on the platform on the whole. And for the most part, it seems as though the numbers are backing that up. With a lot more likes, views, and comments being dropped, particularly on some of my more recent videos than has historically been the case, particularly in the short terms after videos are initially released. Needless to say, I'm pretty stoked about that development, and it certainly encourages me to continue to put additional effort into making new content for the channel long term. Having said that, I do have to acknowledge that my growth here on YouTube has still been pretty slow, despite being steady, which means that it's still not very practical for me to dedicate any additional time to the channel in the upcoming year. In fact, what a deep study of my analytics in the past 12 months has really revealed to me is that it might be in my best interest as a content creator to put out even fewer videos per year than I do. As when I release a video that underperforms, it tends to have a negative impact on the growth and visibility of the channel in the YouTube algorithm. I've always had a tendency to sort of favor a quality over quantity approach where YouTube content is concerned. But one thing that's proved particularly evident in the past couple of years is the fact that it's way better to release fewer videos that perform better, that generate more engagement from viewers, than it is to consistently crank out content for the sake of keeping to a schedule that many viewers may not be compelled to or able to keep up with. As a result, my current thinking for 2019 is that I want to target about 8 to 10 videos for the year, but I really want to focus on making them as high quality and impactful as possible as I firmly believe that's going to be the best way to move the channel forward and continue its trajectory of growth. Of course, another big change that happened to the channel in 2018 is that I began to diversify the sort of content that I create, shifting away from video game content as the primary emphasis for the channel. And that shift is going to continue into 2019. While there will certainly still be gaming-related content on the channel, most notably, I plan to do a review for Anthem when it's released in February, and expect that I'll be covering at least a few other games throughout the course of 2019. However, I also feel like I'm at a point where I really want to experiment with some new types of content, and I also want to continue to expand on some of the concepts that I've recently touched on, such as writing and lifestyle topics. All in all, I think these changes are really going to end up being very good for the channel, and result in me creating much better, more interesting content for you folks to watch. I know some of you might be disappointed to hear that once again there are going to be fewer videos released than what you may have become accustomed to, 
but based on the way that YouTube tends to work and all the best data that I have available to me at this point in time, I really do believe that this is the appropriate strategy for the channel moving forward. And I'm pretty confident that the end result will be something that we'll all be pretty happy with. To wrap things up, I just wanted to throw out a few brief housekeeping notes. You've probably noticed that the gameplay footage for this particular video features some co-op action from Metal Gear Survive. You may be surprised to note that this actually ended up being one of my favorite PC games for 2018. If you haven't done so already, I highly suggest following the link in the description box down below to see all of the titles that I gave shoutouts to in my most recent blog post. Speaking of which, if you haven't checked out my blog in a while, now's a great time to do so as I've recently given it a pretty significant overhaul to bring it up to speed with a lot of my other social media outlets. As many of you know, I've spent the past couple years building up a reputation as a writer of fiction, having now released two novels. That's something that I definitely intend to continue to cultivate over the next several years. And you'll absolutely be seeing more about those efforts on the channel when anything happens that I feel you folks might be interested in. Finally, I just wanted to give a big thanks and shout out to everybody who's watched my content over the years and engaged with it in various ways. 2019 is going to be my eighth year here on YouTube, and with 120 subscribers on the channel, over 100,000 channel views, and well over 300 videos in my library, I definitely appreciate all the time and effort you folks have spent over those years to help grow the channel into what it is today. And I'm absolutely looking forward to dropping some great new content for you folks to consume in 2019. Having said all that, I am going to bring this video to a close. Hopefully you folks have enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. If you'd like to see more videos from me in the future, be sure to hit subscribe. And I will see you next time. Holy shit. <laughs> I got a large heavy arrow arrow special quiver. Nice. And a medium heavy arrow special quiver. So I could technically I could equip like both of those. <laughs> oh yeah. Look at that. Medium grenade pouch. <laughs> oh my god, you're gone. Holy shit. Wow.